They got a naked porn star who's going to do, I mean, date. <laughs> if you want to, we have to call it a date. Hey now. It is a date. Three guys are going to try and win a date. Yeah, there's hey much debauchery left to go on this morning. <laughs> bring, in, bring in Tabitha Stevens and the judges and everyone. I'll get this set up and then we'll take a break. There are judges? Yeah. Oh, wonderful. I don't have, this is out of my hands. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't want to put this in your hands, Thank Robin. Thank you. <laughs> Tabitha Stevens is a very attractive porno star, good body, and she's really willing to go the extra mile for this show. I got, I got to tell you. Let's take a look at her. She always looks uh, different. We said, yeah, she's always getting kind of surgery to make herself yeah. better, which is good. What's so, she done now? Tabitha is going to date one of the listeners, and uh, three guys... So we said, what would you do to date Tabitha Stevens? One guy's going to come in and eat dog duty. Another guy is going to eat a McGriddle sandwich from Jeff Curro's behind. Oh, my. <laughs> and then uh, there'll be another guy. What's the third thing, Gary? I forget now. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, this guy, is his friend's going to make a pube sandwich, and he's going to oh. eat it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, pube sandwich. Wow. <laughs> And then the judges will decide who gets the date. But we're going to watch him make the sandwich. Where's Tabitha? Uh, she's on her way up. She's on her way up. But now the Where's guy, all the judges? Um, they're also... Everybody's ready. We need to break to get everybody in place. Why don't we get them, just get them, get them in here? Okay. Come on, walk we'll, in. We'll bring them in. Arnold Schwarzenegger's here. Really? Who is running for governor. Boy, I'm shocked that he's still doing things like this when he's running for governor. Uh, he'll do anything because he's a little bit behind in the polls. Cruz Bustamante's ahead of him. All right. Yeah, up, here's Tabitha looking fantastic. Better than you've ever looked. Yes, look at you. Look at you. What has she done now? You're a hot chick who's willing to bang anybody, pretty much. Yeah. Except for black guys. Yeah. <laughs> Except that whole group. Uh, well, you know, that leaves about only a billion people out. <laughs> Do you take any drugs? Do I take any drugs? Yeah. In order like... to bang all these people? Yeah, I'm just saying you got to be high to, to, to bang all these people. No. No? You're completely straight. I'm completely straight. You drink, right? No. You don't even drink? No. I have drinks very rarely, and if I do, it's a mixed drink that's watered down, and there's only one. You might need to drink once you have to be with one of these guys. One guy who eats dog duty. Oh. We have three guys who Did are willing. Did you tell her how they're competing? Yeah, you didn't tell me. That. We have three guys okay. who are willing to do anything mm -hmm. to get the date with you. One and guy's we willing. We mean anything. One guy's willing to eat dog duty. Another okay. guy's going to eat a pube sandwich. Oh. And another guy. Is eating the McRiddle out of Jeff Curro's butt. Yeah, you know, I don't have to kiss these guys. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, you got to do something much worse. You. you just have to have, you know, no, just date. You just have a date. Yeah, date. I'm sorry. Date. Date. Yeah, see, yeah. dating is different than mm. kissing. Our judges, by the way, Tabitha, and you look great. Thank you. What are you promoting? Anything, uh, anything big going on? I am now a rock star. What, what are you, you talking about? Come on. What do you mean you're a rock star? No, really. I have my own band and everything. Do you have the CD with you? I don't have the CD with me. We play cover tunes. Oh. Actually, we should Where challenge you your band. Uh -huh. uh, um, we play at the Cat Club on Sunset. My band is filled with famous musicians. Right. And I sing. Okay. Wow. Pretty good. So do you have a, you have a date in mind that you're going to... We're looking in November to do a benefit concert for kids with AIDS. Really? Yeah. All right, good. You look good. Your body's tighter than ever. Thank you. You don't seem to get sloppy at all. You probably don't even eat. Well, I eat. A little bit. A little bit. Have Where's you the done judges? something else with yourself? You look fantastic. Well, what did you I, do now? I, I loaded my head up with Botox. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, ago. that's it. Can you tell? Yeah. Yeah, oh, wow. it's not moving. Hey, baby. Good. How you doing? Yeah. Thanks, all right. <laughs> Isn't Who is she this? so cute? Who's this? This is Serena. Oh, hey, Serena. Come on. Hi. Sit down. One of the judges. Hello, You're a judge. Hello, Serena. Oh, Serena's going to be judging? Serena, how are you? Great. How are you doing? Get the microphone right in front of your mouth. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Serena's in the movie Cabin Fever, Yes. which oh. I've seen half of. It's quite good. You haven't seen the whole thing? I haven't seen the whole thing yet. Oh, you have dark hair in that movie. I, uh, yeah, I know. Yeah. Oh, you're the chick with dark hair. I thought yeah. you were the chick with blonde no, hair. she's oh, the dark one. Hair. Hair. I was like, Cabin Fever. Jeff Caro is a judge and also will be participating in this uh, in this contest. Isn't that a conflict of interest? Wait no. a second. Now he's he's just going to, we're going to use his butt as a serving tray, that's all. <laughs> and 
And by the way, running for governor, thank you for doing this, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Well, then it's great to be One here. second, Arnold, the microphone. Oh, going on. oh, there you go. Wow, this is unbelievable. It's great yeah. to be here, Howard. I mean, you're looking great. Thank you. Uh, you're physically fit. Uh, right. uh, you're trim. You're looking good. Thank you. And uh, Robin, I see over here. You look fantastic. <laughs> well, thank you, Arnold. And uh, oh, Adi, I see you. Good I to see you. I see you timely. You're here on time. That's good. <laughs> right. right. Good to see you. Right. And good luck. You know we're supporting you 100% with your run for governor. Well, I appreciate that, and uh, I tell you, I'm glad to be on the show finally. I mean, I could not come on if all this crap was happening, and I'm glad to be here finally. It's right, great. and you're getting more specific on the issues? Absolutely. I'm going to take care of everything. What right. are the issues? Uh, I will get into that later. <laughs> right. All right, don't get into it now, because we'll right. I mean, we're here to judge uh, a contest. We need to have fun. That's right. Uh, all right. That's right. All right, Jeff, That's you think it. you can stay focused for this? All right, He's good. got you a know, here. Bitch. He'll be focused. All right. I'm ready, dude. And Serena, uh, how'd you get the job in Cabin Fever? How'd that happen? Um, well, you know Eli Roth. Eli Wright, the director. Go okay. ahead. Yeah. So, um, yeah, him. <laughs> Eli, who used to sit by your door. All right, great. Eli, Eli, Eli Roth, you Eli know him? Your door yeah. And, um, yeah. Yeah, I know, but how did you get the part for the movie? Did you, yeah. did, did you audition? I auditioned for You auditioned? It. You're an actress in Los Angeles? Have you been in any other movies? Yes, I have. Yeah, you got a boyfriend? No, I don't. No boyfriend. How old are you? 23. 23, the age I date. You look at your boyfriend? That's the age I go with. I read a Jeff trying to night. move in. I'm sorry, what? I watched your movie last night. You watched my movie last I did. night. Did you enjoy it? I did only half of it, though, actually. Only half. Before. All right. All right. Well, you'll get to the second she's half. Just, she, just, just so you know a little bit about her, she, I, you were not another teen movie. I right? was. One of the interns recognized her. He's madly in love with her. She did oh, do, I'm, uh, I'm madly in love with your intern. He's you are? cute. Mike is a doll. Mike? I don't know who that is. All right, go ahead. And uh, she was on <laughs> Son of the Beach. What do you think about the jerk guy? You were on Son of the Beach. Beach twice? Yeah, I was. I, I played, um, yeah, I was on Sunday Beach. Who'd you play? Once some um, uh, bitchy sorority girl, and then the second time it was the head of the House of Prostitution, another sorority house. Okay, good. Yeah. All right, there you go. Cool. Good Perfect. Yeah. Well, let me tell you something. We have a big job ahead of us, and here's what we're going to do. I need all you of you to help me judges. out. Arnold Schwarzenegger. Already wake up. Arnold Shut Schwarzenegger. Up, you bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Uh -oh. You wanted Jeff to be a judge. I know, it's a mistake. <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger. No, it is it. No. Jeff Currow, you're going to judge. And Serena, you're going to judge. I'm so excited. Three men are going to come in here. They all want the date with Tabitha Stevens. You look excited. Three of these guys will compete. You guys will decide who deserves the date. Thank you. All right. Nice. We're going to come back. We're going to have it all set up. Nice. Arnold, are you okay? I tell you, I just want to say, Jeff here, uh, I remember Jeff from a couple of years ago uh, at the Special Olympics. Right. Uh, he, he actually won the bronze. Yeah. And uh, it was in the discus. That's how he screwed up his arm. All I'll right. Try my right. Best, yeah, bitch. he's a great guy, though. All right, why don't we take a right. break and we'll see what happens. We have some fun going on here right now. We have Tabitha Stevens, beautiful Tabitha Stevens. She's a porn star that everyone loves. You know, Tabitha Stevens hasn't made a movie in two years, a Is porn that movie. Right? No, I haven't shot a movie in two years. In two wow. years. Yeah. The world of porn mourns the fact that you haven't been on camera. Do you camera. think I should do it? All right, I have a question for you. Good. Do you think I should do it, or should I just... Do it, Jeff. Jeff. I'm not talking about you. She should do it? Talking about me. No. no. Do me. <laughs> Oh my God! By it, so I mean I'm me. And right, Robin. I'm, I'm gonna make a movie about you. Same Jeff. goes for you, honey. <laughs> <laughs> you look more edible every time I see you. Wow. Oh. Wow. Right. Nice. <laughs> he was checking her out. Did you see? What was your question? Um, do you think I should go yes. back to doing that? Do you think I should go uh, back? Yes. To... Yes, I do. You I think believe it's good your for talent. I think your talent is important. It's what yes. you do. You got a mm -hmm. kick-ass body. You never know how long that's all going to last. Some Start someday with could... me, honey. And you should go make porn. I will go make porn. Good. It's official. There it is. Why did she stop? Yay! I don't know. You know what? God I... bless you. <laughs> See, you, the Jeff. fans are happy. Yay! <laughs> and you know, what better way to get ready for porn to warm you up than to date one of our listeners? These are extreme listeners. These are people who will do anything to be with you. We have to call it a date, but we know what right. goes on on these dates. Crazy Fs. Right. <laughs> we have three judges. They will be the ones who will decide which guy wins you. Okay. Our first judge is very beautiful, Serena Vincent, who was hitting on Casey during the commercial. Oh, was she? Yes, yeah, she was. I was watching. Mike the intern, too. Mike the intern, too. not me before I left. 
Yeah, she was hitting on you. I saw yeah. that. What's up with that? Yeah. You got some bod. Mm-hmm. Thanks. I, I was yeah. checking it out. I mean, I was like, whoa, that chick's hot. Thanks. Why did I say she has beautiful nipples also? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Isn't that yeah. nice? You I, don't miss a trick. I'm a flesh-eating <laughs> disease, too. <I> saw that. <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger, you are one of our judges. You are running for governor, and thank you for being here. It's a different kind of life for you now. When you were a, a movie star... You would stay pretty much secluded. You do the show once in a while. Now that you're running for governor, you'll even judge a contest like this. That's right. And I wanted to say earlier that uh, uh, Tabitha was talking about how she's not done uh, any movies for a while. If I'm elected governor of California, I'll make sure that she does one every week. Right. I think Thank that you. is important. I could vote for that. That is important. Yeah, you got to get that industry right. going. You have That's a right. great sense of humor, Arnold Schwarzenegger. You're willing to be a part of something wild like this. Absolutely. Uh, even though you have a, you know, you're running for governor, you 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 have smoked pot. That's you, right. Yeah. You you're. Uh, you're a liberal on a lot of social issues, aren't you? Well, I wanted to say that he's talking about smoking the pot. So uh, Robin over here has lost a lot of weight, and she looks fantastic. But she looks familiar. Uh, were you in uh, Gold's Gym in 1978? <laughs> that was not Wait me. a minute. Can you turn around and bend over, maybe? Because, uh, yeah, I it think said you had young. a gangbang with right. uh, a black woman. That's right. I and think it was maybe Robin. Robin. I think it was. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Well, you've got such a great sense of humor about that, even. And uh, we thank you for being here. This is such you're an such honor. Absolutely. Bitch, I have Robin. to say, I have to say of all the... Of all the talk shows that I've done, this is the most recent. Right. <laughs> and you now are getting more specific on the issues. You are for the children, is That's that correct? Right. Yeah. Of course, the children. Always uh, come first. Uh, in my new movie, uh, Terminator 3, of course, uh, I had a giant crane in the movie. There was a scene with a giant crane. And uh, I, we're going to replace all the school buses uh, in the education system with giant cranes. Well, you've got That's a great sense of humor, movie. and I know you're looking right. out for the kids. Right. All right. And exactly. you've always been involved with the Special Olympics. Exactly. <laughs> right. All right. And Jeff Currow, you're going to judge and also participate. You're going to um, help us out with the first stunt let's I'll meet out, let's see who we got first we're gonna um we're gonna meet how we do it how we do it how we do it how we do it how we agreed how we do it Bad. Where's Howie? Oh. Howie how are you you agreed to eat a McGriddle from high pitch Eric's behind uh, High Pitch Eric did not show up. Howie, y'all, y'all baited me, I think. Well, no, not baited you. How, High how Pitch Eric happen? called us last night and said, I can't come in. I have to work. <laughs> and we I said, well, forgot he had a job. Yeah, he's like an idiot. Doesn't understand that, that you got to tell us and give us advance notice. So to tell you the truth. He did bomb out on us, but a great guy, Jeff Currow. Oh, Jeff yeah, doesn't he's have wonderful. A job. I spent Jeff, the morning with him in the lodge. Can we put a McGriddle? <laughs> uh, w- w- would you eat a McGriddle from Jeff's behind? For Tabitha Stevens? Yeah. You would. All right. All right. So, Jeff. He gives good oral. Nice. Nice. Oh, that's good to hear. All right, Jeff. Nice. Why don't you. Thank you, Tabitha. You're welcome, Jeff. Jeff, why don't you get down on the floor? <laughs> And, you know uh, what? Jeff has his headphones on his hat. Can guess going in the thing? top of his ass crack. I ain't going near his asshole, uh, man. For real. All right, Make let's see. There. We'll see. Yeah. Let's oh, see if you really want to have him. We're going to place the McGriddle, and we'll see. You need to have a sip of that, Jack. Can I stick it in there? Yeah, because the top of his ass is a picnic. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Let's, let's first get Jeff on the ground. Help him down. Can we? Man, the can stick it in there. Wait, calm down, Junior. Wait a second. <laughs> Wait a minute. Let me get down. <laughs> Before you apply the McGriddle to the top of my ass. All right, hold on a second. Let me explain to you what's going on. Oh, no. Oh, this is the funniest I thing I've ever seen. Going in his butt. Jeff Caro is passed out on the floor. Jeff, are you all right? Okay. Jeff, Jeff, oh, Jeff, Jeff, look at me. Jeff, look at me. Roll over and pull your pants down. I don't think he can do that. He can do it. Look at him with his little arm. Doug, help him undress. Yeah, do his arm. Help him. Help I'm him out. Sensitive. He's like a bug that's fallen on its back. He can't ride himself. Tabitha, go over there and apply okay. the McRiddle to Jeff's behind. Hey, Howard, I think there's something wrong back there. Oh, is there? What? Is there something wrong back there? No, there isn't. Just help him off with his pants. Oh, bleep. Dumbass. <laughs> oh, I got it. All right, help him off with his pants. Maybe. That'll be the day when a man can't me, take baby? his own pants off. You must see Jeff try to get on the floor. It is the best. All right. Jeff got down on the floor. Tabitha is taking off Jeff's pants. Tabitha will apply the McRiddle to Jeff's behind. You are? Yeah. Nice. I know. <laughs> <clears throat> How far do you want it in? All oh, okay. honey, honey, right. Tabitha, all the way. Let me handle baby. all the explicit stuff. <laughs> okay. All right. all right, so Tabitha, you place yeah. the McRiddle. Okay. For Jeff. 
Tabitha looking more beautiful than ever. Is right. that as Just far as Jeff can do go for getting down? Is that the something floor? on his butt? That's nasty. Wait, there he's What's on his here. butt? I don't. Oh, I don't know. I want to see. I think what is that? The twins have come out to play. No. Wait a minute. What's on there, Doug? What's I don't know, on? but it's discolored. Oh no! It's oh, just a little. I don't know what. That's I can't disgusting. look again. It's I don't know what that is. Yeah. Can I say holy crap? Can because that's what it is. Holy oh, fuck! Oh. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, oh I smell it. Wait a second, Tabitha. <laughs> did Jeff make in his pants? I think he had gas and something came out because it's not oh, right. Really you can do it. You. You didn't make any pants, did you? Case. you no, but don't say the F word. Wait a second. This is a, oh, this is a nightmare. <laughs> this has gone horribly wrong. Oh, no, no, no. What's going on? No, He's not it's, clean. It's definitely not clean. He had an accident. Yeah. He had an accident. Uh, it's not know. a car accident. Disgusting. Did you have an accident? Oh, swear to God. He said it's no accident. No, it's a it smells so, so bad. He doesn't bad call here. it an accident, <laughs> Howard. <laughs> you know what I think it is? What is it? I'm looking on the monitor. I think that Jeff only has one hand, and I don't think he can clean himself properly. I am not cleaning it. Doug, clean him off. <laughs> I want my ass perfect. This is job. Fuck you. Hey, kid. wait a second. Oh, yeah. <laughs> microphone away. Wait, Jeff, wait wait second. Jeff, no F word. <laughs> Stop with the F word. F you bitch. <laughs> Jeff, you're making a mockery out of this, Jeff. I give you a mockery. I... Would you, you give head. Jeff his McRiddle so this gentleman can eat it already? You want me to do it for real? Go ahead. Yes. Can I, I can hold it's my up nose. To this right? Yeah, you can All hold right. your nose. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! I don't believe this. Howard, you, you have to look at this, man. You have to see what's going on. You should come around and take a look. Oh, look let me see what you're doing. Back. I don't think you want to do this. Take it easy, Jeff. Howard. Jeff, lay down my on the floor. My knees are killing me. Jeff, lay down on the floor. Howard, Howard, it's not possible. Have you seen one? Why the, no. For real, Howard. Come on, man. That's not even right. What's the Come fuck? on. Nah. I'm not. Nah. Nah, nah Howard. For I mean, real. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. Things well, have gotten worse. I'm going to give you a, cho a choice. Even though things are bad back there, oh, will God. you eat the McGriddle or not? I'll eat yeah. one bite out of it. You will. Bitch. Even though that's bad. One bite. Wow. You really do want Tabitha. No, this, dude, if this How, guy you does see that. what my fingers have nice. tattooed on them? Yes. That's for Tabitha. Wow. I'm still voting for the dude cute. that eats his shit. No, wait a second. Um, get the, Jeff get is get the microphone. Like a seal. Get the microphone away from Jeff. Jeff. <laughs> Jeff, roll over and apply the McGriddle. One bite. <laughs> All over. This is disgusting. You have you seen what's no, going on? No, I have no show? idea. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you do oh, not want to see this. Oh, oh, look at that. His <laughs> underwear is that. brown. It is not one white. Bite. That's it. One bite. One bite. One bite. Okay, one one bite. bite. One bite. No. No, hey. oh. All right, hold on. You, you know what? <laughs> Forget it. I don't know if I can do it. All right, Jeff, Jeff, <laughs> get Jeff out of here. here. Get the McGriddle bite. out of here for one second. Okay. Since you were willing to take a bite, I'm just going to... Yeah. You can't. I mean, it, it wasn't ever supposed to be that way. He, he was, yeah. was going to do it. He was going to do it. He was, do it. He was brave. He was brave. Thank you. Look at him. He can't even stand up, Howard. Yeah, all, right, all right, all right, all right. He's going to have to lay there. We can't even get him out of the studio. <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> uh, He'll uh, never get up again. Uh, all right. Hold it a second. Hold it a second. Hold it a second. <laughs> Right. Oh, Get the microphone no. away from him. He's just Wait, we don't have any. Yeah. Oh, right, right, right. oh, see, that's biased now. He's a judge. He's going to knock me out the contest. He ain't judging anything. He's in no condition. All right. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Wait, guys, get them all out of here because we're running out of delay. I can't hit the delay anymore. All right. All right. Everybody out. Everybody out. He got shit on his drawers. For real. I go it. So, 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 Howie, what happened? How, Howard said because I, I agreed to do it, he ain't gonna make me do it. But then they made me leave because Jeff, Jeff was getting loud with me, and I, I don't put up with no one's shit. He ain't gonna call me an asshole, and then me not call him an asshole back. So, I, so, so what was going through your mind when you looked and saw what was going on in his pants? Yo, that shit is nasty. It looked like he shit himself three days ago, <laughs> for real. But Tabitha was right beside me, so. This, it was all good. How do you think Tabitha looked? Oh, she's fine as shit. Let me recap what happened. Wow. All right. Wow. The first contestant was going to eat a McGriddle. Oh, wow. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, that was stop, unbelievable. Stop. 
right. Oh, my God. That is not right. That is not right. The first contestant was willing to eat a McGriddle from Jeff Currow's behind. Oh, my God. Jeff started cursing when we pulled off his pants because it was a lot of, there was a lot of activity back there. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was ongoing activity. Yeah. It's been going on for a while. Yes. I'll tell you that. For weeks. <laughs> Arnold, I'm so apologetic. <laughs> this, is, this is better than any debate I could have gone to. What I do mean, I do uh, with the McGriddle? All right. Jeff. <laughs> oh, I'll take it. Casey, please ask Jeff to leave. Yeah, Adi will eat it. Right. Yeah. Oh, leave. go away, Jeff. You're cursing. You're cursing. You're Whoa. cursing too much. It's I don't have a delay. It's fault. Jeff, great appearance. Is he talking about me? No, I don't know who he's talking about. Oh, I'm going to take that McGriddle on. That was top no. notch. <laughs> oh, oh, Christ. Uh, hey, what are you dumping the beer all over the place for? Uh, fuck you, bro. Uh, what are you fucking? Give me the beer. Yeah, take it. Tom. Out, right out the door. Right out the door. This way. I'll bring you stuff oh, out. No. Right out the door. That hold way. Hold on. No, not hold on. Hold on. This way. Out. Let's go. Hold on. No, it's not. Hold on. Party's over now. Ron, do you You'll get your stuff outside. You Let's have go. to punch me. Then walk. I am. Then Just walk. Don't punch me. Then go. You blew it again, Jeff. How do you feel? Yeah, you just threw a can of beer at Chiasano. Forget it. Man. He's done. Yeah, you never. You're out of here. How do you feel, Jeff? You're probably never coming back on the show ever again now. Bye, Jeff. I want my. Wait in the lobby. You're just looking out to you. Jeff, you want to say anything to us before you leave? Jeff? No. Jeff, you want to say anything to us before you leave? I'm Nancy? Just... Yeah. Don't I'm let him back in. I you guys. And that's all I want to say. What? Say it again? You want to make an apology? Is there anything you want to say? I love you guys. No, I freaking did it, Ronnie. Right, Jeff, I swear to God, Jeff, I did it. Alright, crap your pants. You left the studio drunk. There was a big problem. Is there anything you want to say for yourself? Now's your chance. I didn't grab my pants. Right, but there was definitely something going on. What right? the fuck, man? Oh, wait, 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 listen. No, listen. everybody's giving me shit. Listen, listen to me, listen to me. You cursed on the air. You caused a lot of problems. Is there anything you want to say? Now's your chance. Say what you got to say. I just... No, that's not what I got to say. Wait, wait, you got to get the other guys walking in the studio. I didn't do Come nothing. Up, What's up, Jeff? I didn't do nothing I normally wanted to. But you were cursing a lot on the air and you caused some problems. Well, fucking everybody's talking just shit about me. Well, can I tell you I saw the monitor? You had shit yeah, all over you. Yeah, what did you say? You had shit all over Blood. That's even more gross. It's a lot of different than shit it's even more blood. Than, than blood. You're fine. If you guys want to fucking do that, and fucking do that shit to me, well, fuck you guys. Okay? I hope you're fucking happy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I lost control of the show. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I think he just threw a beer on Ronnie, I think. Oh. He's, he's really angry. Why is he angry? He's probably he goes, embarrassed. He goes, He's embarrassed. He's embarrassed. He's yeah. embarrassed. He goes, you guys are treating me like S. But, but, he thinks it's what our fault. Well, he has to stop cursing. I would have him in here, but he just keeps cursing, and I don't have enough delay but to cover But you know when it. he curses, he curses when we say what's going on. Yes. And we didn't do that. I know. Oh, this is great, Howard. Tom's back there. Tom's running after him. Oh. <laughs> He's got to oh, change boy. his pants. Have you guys, did you guys see what was going on? Oh, that was, that was horrible. <laughs> All right, we're trying to have a nice contest for somebody to win the date with Tabitha. Yes. The McGriddle. You know why I have the McGriddle. <laughs> you can put the McGriddle down now. We're, Jeff we're, is no replacement for High Pitch Eric. <laughs> the High Pitch Eric is a professional. Yes. <laughs> yeah. he, you can't ask an amateur to do that. <laughs> Could Jeff own one clean pair of underwear? Is it possible that any are clean in this position? Well, it had nothing to do with the underwear. They started out clean. They did? Yeah. Really? Once upon a time. <laughs> oh, thank yeah. you. In the store. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Okay. I think we have to rethink the whole contest. Was that Jeff's last appearance here? No. 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 No, he's like our Bob Hope. You can... <laughs> <laughs> he just never just stays. Like, that was fantastic. All right. What happened in all the confusion and all the hitting of the button? A gentleman wanted a date with Tabitha so badly that he was willing to eat the McGriddle.
He was. And even after the big mess in Jeff's pants and everything else, he was still going to eat the McGriddle. He was going to try. Right. But right. a trooper. Exactly. <laughs> and that's a trooper. And yeah. that is. He was that's a pooper trooper. Was, <laughs> that's a real, that's really unbelievable. That's but brave. frankly, you know what I think caused part of the problem was Jeff trying to get to the floor. Uh. I don't uh, think that he was prepared to do right. that. Yeah, Maybe that's it. I don't know. I have one more development. Yes. <laughs> Let's do a full can of beer at our general manager. Oh, no. Is Tom okay? Oh. Yeah, Tom is fine, but I think he's very irritated. Mm. Well, let Jeff sit down and relax yes. a little bit. Let him sit in a room and calm down. I love how we're not throwing him sit? out. <laughs> you want him to sit? He can't Well, sit. stand in a room. <laughs> he's not allowed to sit on anything we own. I just need to sit. That's right. it, When bitch. we pulled down Jeff's pants, there was it some questionable out. material back there. Tom's coming Howard, out. you know what? You couldn't even, it wasn't even lit correctly. I walked by, I showed on the monitor, and I was grossed out. When I walked by it live, it was unbelievable. You don't even, I don't even know what Tom, it is. Tom, did you get hit with the beer? No, I, he's walking out the hall, carrying the beer, spilling it. I grabbed the beer from his hand. As I went to grab it, he dropped it. He didn't throw it at me. Oh, okay. Oh. Right. Oh, Let him go not chill out. Hoping he hit. threw it at me? He's yeah. not a bad guy. He just misunderstood. Yeah. Arnold, you're much bigger in real life than you. Yeah, I appreciate that. And uh, be careful. Don't step in the doo-doo down there. <laughs> Watch your feet. Uh, <laughs> I don't know exactly what just happened, it's but the show now is back. I'm not sure I know either, but it's I back can't under control. Our, our digital capabilities. I, I understand. <laughs> All right. Everything's calm now. I had enough of an accident. Big whoop. <laughs> Look, a lot has happened in the last hour. Just to recap, because I do have to end the show at some point. Jeff Caro, I, I brought him in to be a judge for the Tabitha Stevens win a date contest. He was nice enough to agree to allow someone to eat a McGriddle from his butt. After we had our original person back out. Hypercharic, who is dead to me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you should really ban him. Yeah, yeah, he's gone. He's What's, gone. What? I mean... He's gone. How can you do that? Yeah. You, I mean, just be honest. I have my job in the parts department. And, uh... Anyway, my point being that when we pulled down his pants, there was a lot going on back there. Nobody's clear what it was. Some people are saying blood. Some people are saying duty. We don't know what was in his pants. Some are saying both. But there was clearly <laughs> something there that shouldn't have been. And what has happened, Jeff is like now out of his mind. He says, we're mean people. I don't know why he's saying this. I told him if he could come in here and make a statement and not curse, I would have him you back have in. have him back in? Okay. Yeah. Let him come in. Because I don't know why he gets upset with us all the time. I don't know why he'd be upset with us. I'm willing, you know, I, I like Jeff, but he has no right to be upset with us. Are you calm now? No. <laughs> he got another beer. Are you now calm? I'm I'm calm, Howard. And you understand the rules? I understand the rules fully and compliably. All right. Because I know you're wasted, but the point is I still need you not to curse. I hear you, dude. If you're going to curse, I can't have you in here. I hear the curse. All right. Let me explain no, what happened. Nothing more. Here's what I'm going to tell you. Okay. I like you. Thank you. I like having you on the show. That's why I had you down here today. Thank it's the you. first time I've asked you to judge anything. Thank you. You were very nice. You said to us, we will, uh, since Hypercharic was a pussy and backed out of uh, using his backside as a dinner plate, right. that you would use your backside. Exactly. And that was very generous of you. Thank you. But when you we, should have told us it was already occupied. <laughs> When we, when we pulled down your pants, we were surprised by what we saw. I saw it, too. But that doesn't make us mean people because we were shocked by what we saw. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> so how, how do you get angry at us? Casey, go stand next to him and make sure he stays standing. I'm all right. He can't even, he can't even hold himself I'm up. I'm all right. I'm all right. I'm okie dokie. Right, can you stop drinking beer for a second? Yeah, we're trying to talk to you. All right. Why do you accuse us of being bad people if we see something in your underpants? There is something there. I'm not lying to you. It, it wasn't nothing. What you guys saw in my underpants, I have a freaking blister. Okay, go ahead. Freaking, not effing, freaking. 
Hear that, Tom? Cheap and Sano. <laughs> Cheap and Sano. That's all it was. Wow. Well, it was nothing, dude. Well, that's all not, right. That's not well, gross at all. Wait a minute. You know, we were. All right, uh, Jeff. I'm going to do something for you, Robin. I think this is important right now. Oh. I'm going to show you tape, videotape oh, of what we saw in your oh. underpants. I want you to see. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. What, the, the, what we can, saw? Can you st- can you see that? But I turn around like. All right, you going to be able to turn around? <laughs> all right. Oh. All right. Roll the tape. Almost fell there, dude. Roll the tape. Now look. Hold on. You'll be able to see in a minute. <laughs> Can't wait till this airs on TV Friday night. All right, you see what we saw now? Did you just see it? That was... All right, that's blood. That's blood over the freaking underwear. All right. Okay. He acts as if that's nothing. You shouldn't have blood in your underwear. That's all I'm telling you, as a I friend. Do when I have a sore there. But why do you why have would sores? You offer? Because you guys wanted me to, Robin. Uh, no, he was being. He's being. No, no, no. But if you know you. you have a problem, would you offer to do that? Would you agree to do I'm that? I'm not Jeff the drunk. Well, I freaking do. Okay. You freaking do what? I freaking do offer. No, you freaking have a problem, is your point. <laughs> no, I freaking offer. Not effing. Where the hell freaking. are you, Artie? Back oh, where I, I always it. am. What are you talking about? Where I usually I? see your freaking head. Uh, All right, thank you, and uh, good luck. Oh, Jeff oh, the there drunk. There's another oh, beer. There's another the beer. Oops. <laughs> All right, Jeff. Thank you for participating. I tried. All right, you did. You did a good job. Bye, Robert. And Bye, take care Jeff. of the blood in your underwear, dude. That I might love be a real. You, Robert. That I could love be an indication too. of colon cancer, dude. Yeah, it was coming out of my a hole, bitch. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, Jeff the drunk, everyone. Okay. Take care, Howard. Jeff, would you like to spill anything else? I love you. I love you too. Who among us hasn't Robert, had bloody ass, I Robert? Right. Bye, bye. Already? Yeah. Uh, all right. Okay. Okay. Go, go. Go. Leave. Leave. Leave now. You did a good appearance. That's all. It's enough. Come back another time. Love you. Love you. <laughs> Jeff the drunk loves us. I'm gonna walk out. We're in a Derek Jeter shirt. Yeah. Yeah. Yankee fan. I didn't know that. Uh, back that way, Jeff. Uh, Can I tell you? Uh oh. You started Can I tell up something. You what happened? What? what? I went to the Yankee game with my buddy. First Yankee game I ever went to, right? So we're there. I don't care. What? I don't even care. Jeff, you happy now? Uh, Welcome right to the lobby. What's the matter? All right. Before you were yelling and crying and cursing in the hall, you feel better now? Yeah, I'm all right. Little Ronnie's talking shit about me. Where are you going? Down the right to the lobby. You're going right to him, right out. You're right out. Yeah, well, they're uh, separated. Later, dude. Another right good right visit, right. Jeff. Thank you. I try my best. Say goodbye, Jeff. Take care. Bye. Later.